Get rid of the greatest alive. We're putting, mother truckers. God dang it, I'm doing What just happened? Bro. Oh my God. Oh my God. Welcome back to another good, good video. Today, we are still down here in Florida, out here at Emerald Hills. And by the title of the video, you guys could probably already tell, but this is literally the longest and hardest golf course in Florida. Today, we're going to be doing another 18-hole special, 3v3 underdogs versus overdogs. Steven, what about the merch? Well, honestly, we are getting really, really close to launching our merch, and I'm getting more excited. As you guys can see, I waited this whole trip. Just to take this on buck oh, off. You have one on. Me and Tig are repping the prototypes. Basically what's happening is we will be dropping our golf apparel line within the next couple weeks. But stay tuned because it's going to be incredible. We have more hats and it's just we have a whole lot of this stuff and it's yeah. incredible. It's all golf apparel, not merch. Just let's, We got to separate that because this is golf apparel. That's merch. That's merch. Hole number one is a 580 yard par 5. Dog leg left. I have a feeling that every hole is going to be extremely long. This is probably going to be one of the shortest par 5s into the breeze. Got to hook a driver if you want to hit driver, because if you don't hit driver, you don't get a bunch of distance. And if you hit driver, you get distance. All right, Garrett, you know what to do. I'm trying to go like up around this tree, like hit a big hook. That does not feel too good. That's, that's all right. That's fine. That might be okay. It's, it's actually rough. fine. All right, I'm just going to put one in the fairway, to be honest. I, I'm not going to do this duck hook. Yeah, get an extra yard here. Good boss. Why so good? I like that shot a little safer, a little better. That looks good too. Is Steven good? Yeah, right on the mat. Wow. Good I was not expecting that. You're not expecting this mat, so I'll get ready for this. Good ball. That's how it what are you doing, Mike? Yeah, Thanks. Oh my God! Good ball. Saving definitely not the best for last. Uh, I had a three iron in hands. I felt good with that, but they hit good ones. So let's try and hit a driver. Five dollars may have left the chat. Settle. <laughs> in the trees. You may, you may find them in the trees. All right, we got 300 yards to the pin. Obviously, this was just a crazy long par five. So we're gonna have somebody lay up and then probably me and Kyle are gonna give it a rip and see if we can go at the green. Maybe get it somewhere around the front edge of the green, but we'll see what happens. That's in play. Did it land? Yeah, it landed just short of the bunker. I chunked it a little. The chunk? Intentional. I meant to lay up. You know, I just want to let them go for it. Get it, Win. That's up there. Kyle's up. What you got? Three iron? Well, I got three iron, but I'm going to go with the driving iron, which typically I don't really like hitting the driving iron off of the ground because the bounce of it makes it really tough to catch right. In this situation, it. scramble, might as well give it a shot. It might get me really close to the green. Well, you said we had 208. We have 242. Dude, I said 249. Hey, baby. hey, my first guess was 220. All right, Steve, no two. Go! Bro, bro, Steven. <laughs> Great shot. What, mother truckers? You guys got like. Gosh, that's like 25 feet. No, that's closer. Dude, sometimes you, you gotta pull the three wood out and just shove it in the door. I got a little two hybrid here. Lost it. Where'd it go? Forward to the car. Might go. be a little right there, boys. You gotta go after it hard. I don't have a club with a three wood, so I swung this as hard as I could. Tad right. Be good. Be good. So good. Be good. Oh, that's gotta be good. Great shot. Is that on? We have two balls on. Steve, we hit some good shots there. Let's go, baby. 
Trust me. All right, guys, coming up to my ball here, the little chunk and run worked out for us. We got 80 yards left to this pin. They're obviously going to make, looks like probably an eagle. So we got to try and make this definitely get up and down. And Mike is going to start us off here. Got you. Oh, Bubby Hester. God, it's actually it's a weird looking shot. I'll take that though. We got a putt at it. They got a really good look at it. We're gonna step our game up here. All right, we have about 25 feet straight up the hill for birdie. And they're in crazy for eagles, so we definitely need to make this. Let's go off the Great roll. Well, they're in for par, guys. We can take a two up lead, go to two under. Breaks off left. Goes left. Hmm. All right, I think Garrett's got two good reads here. Well, one up through the first hole. You can't, you can't beat that. I'm feeling, I'm feeling good. I feel like we're slowly making the transition from underdogs to overdogs. Let's dominate these Kyle Rick Ryers. So this hole is 434 yards, par four. It goes a little bit to the left. You can't, I mean, Steven will aim just right at this left side bunker and hopefully get one in the fairway. I knew it. I knew as soon as I backed off of it. Right. Man, the driver's man. thing looks so confident. Good ball. Good ball. Alright, Team Overdogs, we uh, just gotta find our bearings. We're gonna be okay. We're all hitting driver. We're even far. We're only one back. No sweat. I'm not worried about that. We're right where we wanna be. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm going to sit this one out. That's unfair. I'm going to hit just because I want to swing my ground. Well, if anybody's hitting, I might just hit one for the fun of it, man. Oh, yeah. I just got to do that, right? You top that? Huh? What do you mean? That's right down the middle. That's right down the middle. Literally 100, exactly. Yeah. So it's perfect. I'm going to hit a little 60 or 8, guys. This is where my ball ended up. Matt's was just right back there. We chose to take this one because it's a flat lie. We have a really good opportunity to make birdie here. They also have a really good opportunity. Dude. 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 Oh my, it rolled long. Dude, that was such a good shot. That was. Dude, that just rolled off the green. Dang it, that was right. I was trying to start it at the pin, Steve. I wanted to hit a cut. Too far right, Steve. We're taking mine in the bunker. It's pretty much that simple. Kyle's was all the way up right in, in right underneath that rope up there. There's probably another 60 yards. Because of the angle, we're choosing to take mine, which is right here. We probably got about 85 yards to the green. It's a good shot. It's a kind of a bit of a lesson is sometimes if a pin is like this, you really want to leave yourself a full swing in. So that's why we're taking Mike is here. We got 80 yards left and really just got to do everything we can to bring this in high and soft. Good ball, Kyle. Hey, that's all right. Ah! It's a 
tough shot. Good night. What do you think, Colin? Straight down the hill is going to be tough to stop. Yeah, I think yours is the play for sure. So we're taking Stevens so we can actually stop the putt. I'm only worried about this one because it has a lot more break. That's gotta sit. That's gotta sit in the nice. hole. God dang it, I'm good. Do? What did he just do? God what just happened? Bro, what, what just happened? In the what in the what? You know what? Sometimes you hit shots and sometimes you make birdies. And I do them both right now, boys. If you don't slap the like button, what are you doing? We're good. That putt was incredible. I'm not gonna lie. We had 18 holes of golf though. There's a lot of golf left to be played. You could win part one, you could win part two. Part three is where you gotta finish it out. Kyle's going first. We just gotta get our bearings, okay? Like I said, we're gonna be okay. Oh. Golly, I wrote that well. You see it, Micah. Atta boy, Micah. Hey, hey, yes sir. That's good, that's huge, okay. <laughs> Second hole, didn't want to be two down after two. We got our birdie, one under to two under, on to hole three. Things are gonna get crazy out here today, I can guarantee you that. <laughs> 268 yards to this pin. We almost messed it up, but there's another tee box out here. We we're almost gonna play up there, but. Garrett's got three wood. I don't know what I'm gonna be hitting yet, but this is definitely the longest part. I've played par fours two seven. I got hybrid, by the way. Good ball. I'll take that. With the driver. All right, we got Matt here with a little hybrid, and uh, Steve is out there. He's in play. Gotta go. Right by Stefion. Oh my, what was that thing? I shanked it. Yeesh. That was just an open club face, man. Bobby with three iron. I probably got four iron. Kyra's got five. But he's about to take off right here. Right. We're all in the same spot. Yeah, we're all well, right not me. It's not a bad lead for you guys to go for it now. I didn't think I had enough clubs stepping up to that joint, but we didn't play. Talk to me. Oh it's my. gotta go. Get there. Get over the bunker. Ah, sure. Mm. Back here. Yeah, hit a good shot. Okay. It's in play. Lazy, lazy swing, man. So we had splash down right there. A little bit short, didn't quite catch it the way I wanted to, off the face, but it was a good line, so I'm happy about that. I've um, got a 50 degree wedge, just gonna splash it out. We can definitely get this pretty close from here, so let's see if we can make it happen. Oh, that's short. Uh, that's right. It's a good lead. You want me to go? switch up this order. I want to try going first here. That's a terrible oh. pick. That's good. It's a good shot. Alright Kyle is gonna go first here. We both got work for our pars here on this 270 yard par three. Kyle's been hitting some good putts. I feel like some of those are going to start to fall today and we're going to be able to get in a groove. Let's mm. put the difference. Good roll. Alright, Steven up here. Left to right. He's made a putt like this. When you don't take your time, you don't have any time to be nervous. That's true. Hey, think about it. So I just get up here and look at the hole. Make it. Oh. oh! Why did I do the same thing as Steve? Really? Oh, that's better. That was better. A bogey. We are still up in this match. 
But I tell you, this is where though, this is where the matches are won. Is on this putting green. Here we are, guys. On hole number four, par four. It's drivable to the base of this little hill. We need somebody to on our team to not hit driver. Whoop. A little left. Not ideal. Good ball. I got four iron just trying to get it out there. We don't want to be too close to the screen. Straight ball. Now, since we're in position, I'm gonna go with driver. This might be a hair long if I catch it right, but it's worth get, it's worth a shot. Obviously, probably wouldn't hit the shot in a tournament, but it's definitely worth trying because we can get on the green, we can we can make it two. Oh my talk! Oh my! Oh my talk! Oh my. Oh my talk. Oh, that's I mean, I was right at it, but I don't know. I hope it stays short. <laughs> Made it to the fairway, had to keep one in play because those two knuckleheads wanted to go for it. So we got about 124 yards of this pin and it looks like it's gonna be downwind. Club choice is literally gotta be perfect here. This is a full swing 54, I just gotta trust it. No, that ain't it. Go. That is not it. That's fine though. <laughs> That's not it. I, I love these greens. They're all slanted straight down. So if you hit the green, you're probably not gonna stay on it. Birdie. This green is the size of a turtle back, man. It is just insane. Kyle is long of the green. We're gonna take his. We got about 40, maybe 25 yards to the pin. We need to get something close here because they're not in for birdie. A really good wedge shot, actually. That's good. That's a really good up and down. We are in a pretty decent spot, about 30 feet away. I've seen Steven make some long putts before. Let's make it happen again here, Steve. Oh, I hit that little rock of oh! green putt. Come on, come on, turn. Man, the Seymour putter has been really nice today. I'm not gonna lie. Sometimes I just like watching the ball go in the cup, you know what I'm saying? You know, it's a, it's a weird God. thing! We're still one under. How, how, at what point do we come over, dog? Like, what is the... When's the transition? Yeah. yeah. Okay, if we beat them today on the longest and hardest course, I don't think we could technically consider ourselves the overdogs because I think they've still won more. But as soon as we start winning more, we can probably become the overdogs. Steve, is that good? You're a legend. Dude, why are you carrying our team right now? Perfect baby draw. Right I, at the corner. Okay, I aimed it over those trees like you said. Dude, oh. Matt is actually bombing it. Yeah, that is, that yeah. is disintegrated. Taking after Steve, do a little baby draw in there. I mean, should I even hit at this point? Yeah. That a boy. Yeah. All right. We will be taking mats because mine oh, no. spun a lot. Oh, no. Should be fine. No, okay. It's gonna be just by the red carpet. There's some room down there. Catch it, Kathy. It's not the cart, girl. <laughs> Well, 
Gary, Gary, Gary. Gary, Gary. Don't walk in front of the camera. Cow, cow, cow. Gary just said, uh, you want, we're gonna try to lay up to about 180. I feel like someone should go for it. Oh. I was off the toe. Not ideal. Okay. All right, I'll get well. Yeah, Gary, okay. And that's in the water. Fair way, fair way, fair way. Dude, what are we doing, guys? Am I in the rough? I don't even know. I might be in the highway. Oh. Good ball, Kai. Boys, that's good. I saw. I'll hit one see if we like a little different yard. Mm. So we have 117 yards. We're, we got to kind of change up our strategy a little bit. This course is not necessarily about length all the time because it's just so much strategy involved. So we're going to try to start playing a little more strategic. We got 117 yards for our third shot. Kyle's going first. That's a golf shot. That is a golf shot. Kyle. <laughs> we have to unfortunately take mine surprisingly my ball landed in the water I think Garrett went OB and Steve went in the water too my ball kind of landed right in here somewhere in this water up here so we have to drop back here Ooh, just because it kind of crossed the water right here we have to try to get up and down for par that's the only thing that we're worried about here because I think they're getting up and down for birdie right I got five iron but I'm debating on four I'll probably hit five Might be right about six, man. Steve, Steve, please Keep be wrong. the Keep. Oh, dude, Why? Dude, you hit that so good. We are struggling on this one, to say the least. The ball's not doing what it's supposed to do. You know, it's just at that point of goal. All right, we have decided to take mine. It was a trash four iron, as you guys can see. It, it had the right distance, just the ball doesn't do what I want it right now. Steven, nice shot. Great shot, Sit Steve. Down. Get right. Shot. That's a tough little, it's a tough little go at it. We got a chance for birdie here, which is absolutely huge. This could be a potential two-shot swing hold. That was a spin up. Oh, okay, dang. Oh, man. Boys, we just got away with one. Oh, we did. We're still going to lose this hole, though. This will be all square if Steven makes it. All right. All square. We got away with one there after all hitting it out of play on our second shot. But we are currently even par and they are even par. On to the last hole of this video, hole number six. Let's get it going, guys. One seventy pins in the back edge, island green, but it you know it's pretty generous green. So a lot of wind up there, hurting from the right. So I think the ideal shot's gonna be a tight draw, a bit under the wind. Wagon, is it over? Go, 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 go. That's in the hole. Get in the hole, Tiger. Get up there. Go, Tiger. Long, low. Yeah. That was a good shot. It looked like it was going to be in the hole, but he's a little long. Bubby's out there to the left. Now, 
like that. That is a little rat. It's a little left, but it's going to be perfect. Yeah. Oh, what? I hit an easy seven. Literally. Look. Bro, we saw Bobby hit a hard six. No, 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 he hit a, he hit a, I was gripped right here, I took an inch off the club, I took an inch off the club, Full swing six. I hit a hard though, I hit a good. Sit, Steve's got you. Sit, 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 sit. It's cause it never been wrong. Sit. No! <laughs> this is what he's built for. Yep, yep. That looks good. Holding up against the wind. Stay short of the tree. It's still a little long. <laughs> that is crazy. Bro, Bubby has not been hitting the gym recently. My team needed me to slap him on their fingers, and I, I was able to do it. So we're going to have a long putt nonetheless, but so are they. Last hole, the intensity is super high for good good out here. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying this video recently. It's been, a, it's been insane, the longest freaking golf in Florida. Because we're all square right now, which is the other funny thing. So we're going into the last hole all square. And we have the same exact putt. Like I'm saying, it, like right here. This it'll be like straight over the wrist. Maybe. That could be weird. Run. Go. Run. Keep. Nice. Wow. Good Steve. Putt. I think that's the line. That looks good, Matt. That looks. So good. Oh. Great. Uh, good putt. Y'all can pick it up. Turn in there. Turn in there. Good roll. Yeah, we got three pretty good ideas on where this putt's gonna go. It's it's gonna be breaking a lot, but it kind of stops breaking at the hole. So it's just a matter about getting this first half ready. If we make this, we can get one up at the end of this video going on to next six. I like that. I like that a lot. God. Just made sure I wasn't leaving it short. Nice. Man, six holes, even no, par. This is the hardest golf course I've ever played. This is absolutely incredible. It's a lot of fun though. We're playing 7,900 from the tips, if we didn't already say that multiple times in this video. But that wraps up part one of this three part series out here at Emerald Hills. Like I said, is an extremely hard golf course. We're both even par. Yeah. Going into part two, we hope you guys enjoyed this part one. This course is the hardest course I've ever played. No one's broke par on here. So it's interesting. Three man scramble, what can we do? Anyways, I can't wait for the next, next six holes. I'm gonna be honest. Exactly, stay tuned, remember, this merch is dropping soon, so stay tuned. Peace out.